Hey everybody. My husband has a good tip for anyone that has a pickup truck. If you haul things, uh, he has a way of setting it up so that you can really anchor anything down uh, tightly and uh, not lose anything out the back of your truck. So let's go take a look at what he has. Okay, hi everybody. Listen, uh, my name's Steve. I just wanted to show a little trick that I think is uh, kind of cool. It's worked out for me real well. It might help some of you guys out there that um, got a pickup truck. What, I, what I'm going to show you is just a way to uh, rig up um, some simple pieces of hardware that will give you tie points all across both sides of the bed. I know most pickups come with a couple of tie points in the corners, but I find that it's it's hard when you're just trying to tie something small down or something awkward in shape or when you want to get a lot of points you just don't have them. So what I figured out to do was just got uh, some chain. Chain's not the cheapest thing but it's not uh, that expensive and maybe you have some of it even laying around the house, uh, the garage that you might be able to use. I believe this is a 3 16th chain but obviously any, any size that you had would probably work. So. What I do is basically I take a length of chain that runs down the side of the bed and then I just happen to have a couple of quick links that I use to uh, fasten the chain to the loop or the tie point in the bed. Basically just tighten that quick link up. And I suppose you could use a shackle or another piece of hardware, just something that will tie it right to the, uh, the tie point. And then I take another quick link and a turnbuckle here. And I know there are some other devices you may have laying around for uh, tightening up chain and stuff like that. You could probably use something like that as well. But for me, this is a... Uh, not real heavy duty, but it seems to hold every load that I've ever put together. So I take another quick link, just fasten it right here to this side. So now I have a turnbuckle right here. And notice this turnbuckle has a little eye, a uh, little hook on one end. You can take it and you get it uh, as tight as you can get it. Um, and then once you get it as tight as you can get it by just hooking it just go ahead and uh, take this turnbuckle and tighten it up this doesn't take a whole lot as you can see it's just tightening up along here And I pretty much got it nice and snug. It's just giving you a place all along here to, uh, to tie to. Uh, I think it's pretty cool because most bungee cords can hook into any of the chain or hook around the chain easily. Uh, you can um, got a rope you want to fasten. You can, if you want it to stay in one spot, it's pretty easy to go ahead and put it through a link. You don't have to put it through a link, um, but you can just tie it anywhere along there. It's decently strong enough to secure. And if you got if you've got a uh, ratchet straps, you can hook the ratchet straps on pretty easily as well. Uh, just hook it around the chain. And all of this you should pay attention to. If you do have ratchet straps and chain, you just get one that the hooks fit around pretty nicely. It's great. Anywhere along here, you can uh, go ahead and fasten this. It's really handy than to try to figure out how to tie something down really easily. If you got a tarp, it's real easy because you can lay the tarp across everything. You've got so many points along the way to tie to. Plus, you can just lace 
you know if you got a long rope you can just lace it right through the chain it just works really well and I just thought I'd share that with uh, with any of you guys out there that are uh, just looking for a simple little solution to to a problem that anyone has a pickup truck probably encounters at one time or another so that's it thanks